Hastings is our town, you know it well. From the welcome sign to the high school bell. You say you know it well, that's not quite true. Cause with Take a Hike Mike, I'll prove it to you. There's lesser known businesses and some you've heard of more. But it doesn't bother me cause I just love to explore. Interviewing owners and lending a hand. I'd love to assist for as long as they can stand. Where will I go next? I really can't say. Here's a little warning, cause it might be your way. No matter where I go, one thing is true. With Take a Hike, Mike, it's entertainment for you. Four score and seven years ago, Take a Hike, Mike, learned all about the Civil War at the Leduc Mansion in Hastings. Mike first met up with the master cook, Spencer Johnson, to get his itinerary for the day. Spinning wool, chasing chickens, and playing music were just a few of the ways Mike spent his morning. It was then time for Mike to learn the ways of battle. Through firearm training, manning the cannon, and even mastering the art of the Gatling gun. War, huh, yeah, what is it good for? Let's now take a look at Mike's hike to the Leduc Mansion for the Civil War weekend. Well, hello, sir, Spencer. Yeah, yeah, who are you? Uh, my name is Mike, uh, Take a Hike Mike. So what do we got going on here today? Some type of Civil War event, or well, what is this? It's, it's 1866, you knew that. Whoa, yeah. okay. And the okay. war just ended last spring, but all the soldiers are coming back. Okay, um, so it's like a party here. Well, in some sense, <laughs> I would say that. Okay. Um, okay. It was a war, you know, it was a war. And then um, some, some, some of the boys didn't come back, and it was very, very sad, but William LeDuc come back and uh, he was a quartermaster officer in the army and he helped feed the soldiers and things so we're sort of celebrating that in some sense. So this mansion is kind of old. Have you ever thought about renovating it on a show like Extreme Makeover Home Edition? I'm not exactly sure what you mean about a show, maybe okay. a minstrel show, but this is okay. a beautiful, beautiful house. About the time the house was being built, the war started, so Leduc being very patriotic left. And he's writing letters and correspondence and trying to get the house built, but it took a lot longer. So mm -hmm. when the war's over in 65, there's still some work to do. Is there going to be a test on this? Oh yeah, you're a good Absolutely. you're a good teacher. You know, you know I should know? think about you know, doing we should that. Think now about the war's maybe over. doing the yeah. war's over. That would be a consideration. <laughs> so where should I start? Well, you know, there's a woman over here named Joanne Bergman. Okay. Who's very close to my heart. Okay. And she's doing some spinning. She's spinning wool, and that's something that women would do before and after the war. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. I'll meet up with you a little bit later. We'll do a little bit of cooking. Yeah. Make some good so eats. You right now, Mike. You take a little hike. Okay. See what there is to see. All right. You heard him. Let's go. Whoa, what do we got going on here? Oh, I'm a spinner. I'm a Mike. Oh, <laughs> hi Mike, I'm Joanne. Hey Joanne, nice to meet you. I'm trying to make, get enough yarn to make it a, a, a uniform for my son, at least a shirt or something to keep him warm. Oh wow, well this, you need my help. Oh yes I do, <laughs> I certainly do. This is a machine and this machine is very old. Okay. And I'm going to turn it and it's going to pull my wool in. Now this Whoa. is wool. This is okay. wool from a sheep. And when I have enough wool, I'll spin some linen, some flax, Whoa. which makes linen. And then I will combine it to make a nice shirt for my son. Do you want me to help by pumping this pedal down here, here, Joanne? Well, I don't think, you know what? If you'd like to sit and try, oh, well, okay. Ahead, I will. I'll so let I've you. proven my skills. All here right. We go. All right, this is the big moment. It is. All right. Let's see what you, hold it here. Okay, hold it here. Yep. All right, foot well, on pedal. Yep. Pedal to the metal. Pedal to the metal. Okay. Go ahead. No, you're not. You. Oh, whoops. Okay, oh. let it suck. Oh, I, I've already. Okay. No, no you, oh, okay. you gotta make it go. You gotta make the wheel go this way. You gotta keep the oh, wheel there we go. this way. All right. How about that? Is that? No, you're oh, going the okay, wrong way. Okay, I'm going the wrong way. way. Should I just whack it like this? That's what you hey, do. Hey, there we go. But don't pull. Oh, don't pull out. Push in. Oh, look at. Look oh my God. Oh my. Oh heavens. my heavens. Okay. It's not bad. So do you want me to pump harder? Well, you can pump harder if you I'll want. I'll pump as hard as I can. How about you do that and I'll just do the pumping. Okay, it's going. Yes. There it yeah, is. There we go. All right. Now we're working. Oh, not oh. opening. Whoa. How was that? That was really good, Mike. That was good. She's that trying to get rid good. of me already. <laughs> okay. I can make a little beard out of this, actually. Oh, that sounds Wouldn't that good. just be cute? <laughs> it's cute. <laughs> 
I appreciate the the flax was doing really well. It's the least Your I can do for you, great. Joanne. I really oh, appreciate you, it. You want me to leave? Yeah, you can head down okay. the road, and there are other things that you can see there. Okay. All right. Well, head down the road. Can I keep the beard, or you can or do you keep wanna... the beard? Okay. Excellent. You have to keep... <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, Joanne. <laughs> it's perfect. All right. <laughs> thank you, Mike. Thank you. <laughs> have a good one, Mike. <laughs> Whoa, well hey, what's going on guys? Good. Hey, my name's Mike, what's your name? Jasper. Jasper? And my name's Oliver. Oliver and Jasper. What is one thing I should check out here? Here's one thing. Oh, one the thing, chickens. okay. chickens. Okay, chickens. You can feed them if you find a big leaf or something. Well, okay. Make sure you don't get bitten like I did. Oh my gosh, do not get bit. We're gonna go okay. check out the chickens, the roosters, chickens. and we're gonna watch our fingers. Oh, should be some kind of chickens over here somewhere, I hear. Rooster, rooster. Rooster want the food. Here, rooster, 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 rooster. Alright. They like it. They really like it. Look at this. They like me. Good chicken. Good chickens. Oh, here's one. Here's a big one. Good chicken. Oh, it's soft. It's soft. Hey, it's a little hen. I feel like I'm finally part of my own kind. So that's why the chicken crossed the road. For a healthy portion of food. Hmm. Not that bad. Went to town the other night. I saw the noise. I heard the fight. Watchman was yeah. coming round. Right old man Tucker come to town. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way, old Dan Tucker, you're delayed to come to supper. Yee-haw! Here's my razor in good order, magnum bottom, just said water. Sheep shell, oats, tuck shell the corn, I'll shave you when the water's warm. Get out of the way! Whoa! Get out of the way! Say what? Get out of the way, old Dan oh. Tucker, you're delayed to come to supper. Left out a few verses. You guys are incredible. What are these amazing instruments that you guys have? This is a banjo. Okay. It's a skin-headed banjo. It uh, is a replica of a banjo that a 19-year-old Civil War troop named Frank Raleigh made in 1862. Well, do you think uh, I could give it a try? Uh, you could. <laughs> Good luck. Uh, this is a left-handed banjo. Okay. Five I... string. Use your index finger to strum down. No problem. One finger down. Okay. Oh, yeah. And then the, your thumb plucks up. Okay. And uh, you either need a really long fingernail or... I just had a manicure yesterday, so I don't okay. know if that's going to be applicable. You know, with another 10 or 12 years of practice, you might be able to pound out a song. Hastings is our town. You know it well. From the welcome sign to the high school. Oh, my goodness. I may have damaged the... Uh, the banjo. The, the bridge fell off. The bridge fell off. Oh my goodness, uh, sir. A I'm... testament to your fine playing. Oh my goodness. Well, so I will give this back to you that. before I destroy it. Thank you so much. I've, it's been returned in one piece. You got the clackers here, right? These are not clackers. These are bones. Whoa, bones. Made with real bone? Made with real bone. Wow. Yes. Okay, so what do I do? Just kind of slap them together? No. I don't you, want to shatter them. You do it in one hand. Okay. You hold them like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this one doesn't move. Mm -hmm. And this one does. And okay. you can adjust whether you do one hit mm -hmm. by keeping your finger tight or whether you do a roll by flipping your wrist and letting it loose. OK. I'm pretty good at that. <laughs> OK, good luck. All right. More with your wrist and less with your hand and your arm. Your arm shouldn't. <laughs> you have to do your wrist right. Loosen up your wrist. All right. <laughs> You're making a sound, but it's going to take a while. And then you dance you while you play these? You can if you want. So how do, how do I sound? Uh, not very good. Oh, okay. No. Oh. But I think you do it very well in the learning center that oh. Prof Professor Longley has over okay. there. Okay, go check that out. His curiosity shop, okay. yes. All right, I'm a curious guy. Let's go check this out. Whoa, Professor Longley? Good day. Hey. I am Professor Longley. Wow, my name is Mike. It's good to meet you, Mike. This is my cabinet of curiosities. I traveled throughout uh, Central and South America in the 1850s wow. and uh, early 1860s and collected the things you see here. This is like antique road show. Do you like rocks, minerals, fossils? <laughs> yes. Do I ever? Oh, well, in that case, uh, you might be interested in from Spain. This is a piece of pyrite. 
Wow. Fool's gold, but it can actually form naturally in a cubic form. It formed naturally yes. like this cube? and you can see a reflection in that cube. Wow, okay. Let me check mm -hmm. my... Yeah. Okay, one second, get that out of there. Okay. Whoa. Do you know what this shell might come from? Is that from a snail? It's from a type of snail. A really a big gastropod snail. gastropod called a conch. Okay. And I've hollowed out the end of this and made it smooth so mm -hmm. I can do this with it. And this will be a bit loud. Mm -hmm. Okay. Not as loud as a cannon. Okay. That is amazing. And you can see how you could hear this from quite some distance. So you Whoa. could use this to, to alert people to whatever you An need to alert them to. Or if Mike is coming. Can I blow in one of them? Sure. Can you do this with your lips? <laughs> That's close enough. Let's see how it works. Is. That is a big tube. It is a big tube. Yes. This instrument is made out of eucalyptus wood, mm -hmm. hollowed out by termites. Okay. And painted, Whoa. covered with a little bit of black beeswax. I did. And if I could ask you to move just okay. that way so I can aim thing. up this direction. Okay. And you play it like this. Oh. <laughs> Wow! That was pretty good. But let me show you how the master plays. Oh, well! Let me show you how the master plays. <clears throat> Can you keep that up for 45 minutes? I'm already winded. I have no <laughs> oxygen left, sir. You want me to hang out here with you all day or what? Oh, I think you should probably go look for a cooking demonstration. You're maybe, trying to get rid of me already. Maybe Johnson's Camp would be the place to go. Okay, okay, over to Spencer's for some cooking, some good eats. All right, good let's, idea. let's check it out. Is that from the 18th? No, there. Oh, smells good around here. Well, hello, ma'am. Baking bread. Baking That's bread. That's why it smells good. I'll and show you. And who are you? I'm Mrs. Bauer. You're Mrs. Bauer. Mm -hmm. Whoa, this bread looks good. Can I take mm -hmm. a bite out of it? You might want to wait a little okay. while. Okay, okay, might be a little yeah. bit toasty. And the bottom is a little, isn't quite done. The top obviously is. So oh, I'm going to put it back delicious. in for a few minutes. Yum, yum. So I see so, a chicken over here. <laughs> is that the dead chicken? No, it's a ham. Oh, it's a ham. Okay, okay. <laughs> so my chicken is still safe over there. Your chicken the farm? Is, uh, <laughs> chicken. Uh, well, it could be a nice juicy chicken, but it happens to be a ham. Okay, yeah. okay. It smells delicious. Yes. So is there something that I can help you with? Yes. Excellent. I need a butter churner. Oh, well, look no further than right. right here. Master right over here. butter churner extraordinaire. Okay, we're going to go on a journey. So we're making butter, wow. and I've had a number of children here doing this. Okay. And it... So I should be qualified to do it, seeing as I'm a 29-year-old man. Yes, there you go. That's just cream. That looks the good. the creamery right next door. So do you taste this Local. Ever? Can't put your hands in there. Okay, don't, don't put, put my hands in, in there. Don't put my hands in there. <laughs> I'm getting excited. All right. Okay, so here's what you do. You hold on with one hand because it's a little loose, and then you just go like this. Okay. Just go up and down? Just go up and down. All right, here we and go. And you can sing your ABCs if you want. That would be or silly. You can sing another song. A, B, C, D, E, F, there you D, go. H, R, G, K, L, M, N, O, P. <laughs> Q R S, sing it with me. T U V W X A what Y and Z. Now we know our ABCs. Give me more butter, please. Oh, is it ready? Yes. No, but this is what it will look like. Okay. My arm's already tired. It'll be yellow. Okay. It goes from white cream to yellow. So there'll be butter and there'll be buttermilk. So we can wow. bake with the buttermilk, and as soon as that bread is done, you can yep. go back and have some butter on it. So how much more pumping does this need? It's going to need probably another 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Depends that on... Must... My help disappeared a few minutes ago. Well, that's what I'm here for, yes. Mrs. Bauer. Yes, so. I appreciate that. Cool, cool. So we will let this be. <laughs> sure. So anything else I should check out here, Mrs. Bauer? Yes, I think you need to see Mr. Johnson. Okay. And check out the ham that's cooking. Oh, okay, okay. And Not the cabbage and the sausages. Wow. And he's an excellent. I'm licking my lips already. Right. Let's check it out. Thank you. Yep, thank you.
Whoa, Spencer Johnson, I'm back. Mike! Mrs. Bauer sent me over. She said you need some help, maybe? Yeah, yeah, I do a little okay. bit. Okay, okay. So we're cooking for the troops right now. Okay. Are you making any SpaghettiOs over an open flame? Spaghetti SpaghettiOs? Up, up. Spaghetti. Ne never mind. <laughs> so this, this is not the Italian Civil War. <laughs> so we need to check these potatoes here. Okay. I'm going to move these out of the way, but you got to be really, really careful. This is really hot. Because it's really this hot. This is hot. I can feel it on my face. So heat. So I'm going to do one of these, and you hold this. This one's not hot. Okay. No, not that. Oh, okay. Yeah, this one right okay. here. called right. an S, so cuz. I thought it was a mustache for me to wear. That maybe. could be, yeah. Wow, so you're gonna pull the kettle out with I'm one of these tools? I'm gonna pull the kettle with okay. this tool. Try not to fall in the fire. Oh my gosh. Set it down here. Okay, so you get the next one, a little one. Okay, so get that one out. So can I put my hand on the wood up yeah, here? Yeah, this is nice and sturdy. All right, here we go. So just reach in and pull this off. Yep, Molly put the kettle on. All right, whoa, all right. In fact, whoa. that's the other thing I was gonna say. Now watch down brown yep, behind you. Yeah, sounds good, sir. You, you think these taters are done? I don't know, how do we find out? Okay, just take this in. Yep. Now which one should I try, sir? I don't know. All right, let's go in here. Oh, this looks good. Hot. I gotta blow it, it's really hot. Yeah. I have a sensitive little mouth. <laughs> <laughs> but it's well, it's well used. Mmm. Those are done? Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, you could just put yeah. it on the table or on a plate. Put it on plate. the table? Yes, okay. I, I sanitized this you table You sanitized earlier. the table? Okay. Yeah, this is just Pull perfectly. Whoops. Oh, oh my goodness. One. I am so sorry. There you go. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. 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 Very good. It's like five. It's good. Good sausage. It's good. Where should I go? Where should I go next? You know where you should go next. You go up that way. Okay. That way, you'll find. George Daniels. Are you sure you don't want me to stay here and keep working? You should come back. I should come back. Come back right. after a right. while. I'm not done Because the kettles are need to be cleaned. Yeah. Oh man, you want me to wash dishes? Mm -hmm. All right, well here I go. I'll go visit right. them. Oh, you take this. See you later, Mike. All right, thank you, sir. All right. Well, hello, sir. How are you? Good. You must be George? I am George Daniels. Hey, nice um, to meet you. Here. Have a seat, would Oh, you? wow, okay, cool. So I noticed you got a pretty cool canteen there. Son, I'm glad you asked that. Yeah. Because this has to do when William LaDuke found me okay. and enlisted me in the Union Army and I was issued a canteen, mm -hmm. so I felt like a true soldier. What do you think of my canteen that I have? Pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> you want, the, the, the temperance lady's right outside. Okay, okay. We should probably hide this hide this in here then. Okay, okay. Not in my bed. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's going back in the pocket. Back in the pocket, sir. <laughs> I'm a southerner. Whoa. Hello, Hello sir. sir. What do we have going on here? We're smoking a little pipe here. Smoking a little pipe? Yeah. Would you like to try? I've always wanted to try a pipe. Uh, what is your name? Uh, Mike Kenzel. Mr. Kenzel. Okay, so this is an authentic, real pipe here. So how does this work? Well, you first you have to load it up. Load it up, you got a little baggie there? Sure. Sweet. And this is legal, correct? Oh, yeah, this is uh, tobacco. Okay. All right, so what do I do? Do I just grab a little pinch mm -hmm. of it? All right. And this goes in the hole? Yep. All right, put that in. Take your little finger and... Dab her down? Dab her down, not too tight. I'm becoming a man today on camera. You might get a little dizzy. A little dizzy, okay. That's good TV, right? Hello, hello children. Hey, Mike. hey how's it going? A really big fan. Oh, cool. You like take a hike, Mike? Cool. I'm about to smoke a pipe for the first time ever. <laughs> cool. All right, so here we go. All right, I broke it. All right. I'm right. trying to go. Oh, you got it? He's going to help me out. <laughs> Keep walking. Oh, it's working. Okay. This is crazy. This is crazy. Don't try this, you're too young, but someday try this. <laughs> oh. Usually my pipes just shoot bubbles. This is unique. <laughs> well, sir, maybe I could just sit here and smoke with you all day. Well, maybe we'll just forget it. Oh, forget it? Some people aren't cut out for smoking. Okay, well, I guess I should maybe hit the road then. All right, off to my next stop. <laughs> okay. Hello, first sergeant. Hey, oh, uh, you are? Uh, my name is Mike. I'm here for some uh, weapons training. Ah, recruit. Yes, sir, yes, Excellent. sir. Excellent. Attention. Uh, no saluting. Oh. You'll learn that later. Okay, sir, yes, Hands sir. Hands on your sides. Now, I'm going to issue you with a rifled musket. Oh, wow. A real gun? Oh, wow, a real gun. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, all right. Cool. 
Wow. Do not point oh. the weapon until you've been appropriately okay. trained. Yes, sir. Does this gun have to be so heavy? This gun is not even heavy. Oh, okay. Loosing the hand from the butt. Okay. And Take my hands off my butt. And it to the okay. trigger guard. Trigger guard. There. Yeah. Straighten up, Mike. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now, aim. Now you will place it on your shoulder as you are aiming. Yeah. And fire. Without Bang. It. Yes, perfect. <laughs> I got him. Did I hit him? The next, the next command will be recover arm. So you bring it back to where you started here, right here on the side. I think I shot at that guy on his cell phone over there. OK. All right. But, what do I yell when I run? Anything. All right, anything at all. OK. And I'm Charge! Going... Ah, loud noises! Ah, I'm still running! Woo! Did I pass? With uh, three months more, three more months of about nine hours a day of this, okay. you're going to be a heck of a soldier. All right. You're the right size. You're the right age. You obviously have aggression. We will make sure you never do that again. I'm uh, I'm relegating you to the artillery. Artillery? Yes. Go off and see the see the gunners. All right, sir. Yes, sir. All right, hello, gentlemen. I was hello. sent by the infantry. I'm looking for the sergeant. Oh, speaking. Sir. Hey, how we doing, sir? I'm doing fine. How oh, are you? Who, I, I'm who doing, am I addressing? Uh, I'm Mike. Yeah, I'm here to impress you. I'm here to lend a helping hand. Let's see how impressive you are. Okay, let's do it. Let's see right. how impressive I am. Whoa, there is some heavy artillery around here, sergeant. Well, this this is a parrot. A parrot. Okay, a like parrot a bird. Rifle. Does like it a, talk back? Or? Spelled a little differently, but it does talk. Yes. Do you have any experience with handling um, handling powder? Uh, squirt guns. If that if that applies. A squirt gun. A squirt gun squirts water. You know. See that chest back there on those on that? Yeah, on the, that, with on the, the two wheels. Yeah. That's called a limber. Limber. Okay. That's full of ammunition. Okay. So. We're going to have you bring some of that ammunition okay. from that chest up to the front of the gun. Front of the gun. Have our uh, number two man, who's okay. at the front of the gun, put it in the barrel. Because I'm the number one man. You're the number five man. Okay, five. Okay. And we're going to place one powder one charge. Powder charge. Got in it. there. All right. Do not smoke. Do not make any sudden moves. Okay. And you'll be all right. Because this could blow up in my pants. Probably not. Okay. But, the, but there's, a, there's a chance, Sergeant. There's a chance my pants could blow up. With cartridge, load. All right, here's my big moment. Now we're gonna make a little noise when this Don't is done. Blow up. This gun has a range of three and a half miles. It is a rifled bore. It's the first rifled cannon used by the U.S. Army. There were many others that came out subsequent to that. They were rifled, but this is the first. Ready. Sergeant wants old take a hike Mike on the Gatling gun. I'm up to the challenge. The cannon was just the start. Take your position. Fire! Man, launching that cannon was crazy. Isn't that cool? Yeah. So, Amy, you're in charge of the Leduc. Is I that know. correct? Is that not the coolest job That's in the world? That's pretty much the coolest job in the world. So, I know it's 1865 right now. 1866. Uh, 1866. And I know no such a thing as websites don't exist no. in 1866. Absolutely. But not. if you were to have a website, uh, a place where people could learn about the Leduc and learn more information, what would that website be? It would probably be LeDukeHistoricEstate.org. Okay. Also, our parent organization has the DakotaHistory.org. Okay. And so, yeah, all those websites, you can find out everything that's going on at the house. So I have a gift for you and all of your friends from the Civil War weekend and the Leduc. We this love is kids. called a hike ticket. Um, so the what Leduc Civil idea. War weekend was featured on Take a Hike Mike, signed Mike Bramer. You're welcome to display this wherever you oh, would like. Oh, we will. We will. Wonderful. We have a lovely place right behind our desk. Cool. Yes. Amy, thank you so much. Thanks, Put a wrap Mike. on it. It's been fun. <laughs> And so, Take a Hike Mike learned all about the Civil War at the Leduc Mansion. 
Mike, there you are. I've been looking oh. for you. Seriously? Oh. You're dressed like Abraham Lincoln? No, no, I'm Abraham Lincoln. No, you are not Abraham Lincoln. Oh. You are Take a Hike. And Mike, what did you get this? Is some cheap costume shop? Look at the silly hat. This is not the presidential treatment I was expecting. That's because you're not the president. You know, Mike, take a hike, Mike. If I'm not wanted here, I'm off to the theater. Where will I go next? I really can't say. Here's a little warning, cause it might be your way. No matter where I go, one thing is true. With Take, Take a Hike, Mike, Mike, it's entertainment for you. <laughs> Oh, <laughs>